Welcome back everybody. We are in episode six of the new to the gym series. Now, just like I told you guys before, and I hate to continuously reiterate on this, but in the first five episodes, what I did was I targeted main muscle groups that you're gonna hit throughout your workouts. So keep in mind, the first episode we did back, followed by by, followed by shoulders, legs, tricep, and now we're on chest. I know in the last video I said that this was actually gonna be our last video, Excuse me for that because I am mistaken. We have to hit our abs still. So next video will be the last video. It will be a beginner ab workout. Today's gonna be the chest workout. Let's go and kill it. So first chest exercise we're gonna go and do is gonna be a flat bench press. On the flat bench press, there's three key things for beginners to remember. One, we gotta retract our scapulas. Two, we gotta find our good hand position. And three, our elbows gotta be tucked. We don't wanna be boxed out. If not, we're gonna put a lot of pressure on our shoulders. We want our elbows nice and tucked to squeeze in like if we have a ball right here between our lat. So what I mean by that is when we come back, retract our scapulas, which in the back, it's gonna make you look like you have that natural arch. That's okay. We're okay with getting this lower part of our back off and our butt never wants to be off. If we're doing this, the weight's too heavy. If we're here, we're okay still. So we got our back nice and arch right here because our scapulas are retracting. Find our spot on the bar. Grab it. We're gonna hit about low to mid chest area, about right here. Notice my elbows aren't way out here like so. My elbows are nice and pinched in like I'm pinching a ball. And I'm coming fluid and up. Come down nice and smooth. Fluid, up. Next exercise we're going to go into for the chest breakdown for the beginners is going to be an incline press, bench press. Now I would recommend doing the free bar, but if you're a beginner, the only reason why I don't recommend it is the fact that coming at that angle right there, one, you can injure your shoulders, two, you could potentially hurt yourself because you're not knowing where to hit the bar. On an incline press, we want the bar hitting mid to upper chest. We don't want to be hitting mid to lower chest like we do on a flat bench press. We want to focus on hitting mid to upper chest. Same concept as we did in the flat, three things, hand positioning, scapulas retracted, and then coming down with our elbows nice and tucked in. Okay, so you notice even though I'm on the Smith machine here and it's nice and guided, my elbows are still gonna be tucked. So instead of them being nice and boxed out, notice I'm pinching my elbows in, I got my scapulas retracted, my lower back is off the pad, but my ass is still sitting on there, my shoulders are back, pinch, right down, hit my chest, explode up. Hit my chest, explode up. Time, chest, Blood of a champion in my veins. I ain't following nobody, I'm in my own lane. Never day in my life, come and feel my pain. I'm balling out like LeBron and Dwayne in overtime. All my life, time to turn it up into overdrive. Gotta live your life with an open mind. Blood, sweat, tears got me so alive. Pull up with a bad one, then a passer. Jerk side with an ass, got a fat one. Used to never get money, your host back then. Now I get both, but never will get a chance to wait the focus on the money, turn the vision to it. Embrace the struggle, and you're gonna get. So the third exercise we're gonna go into is gonna be a pec deck or a chest fly. A lot of gyms, they either have the old school pec deck like this one or they'll have the traditional chest fly or pec deck machine that's got the handles out here where we come out. Since we're using this one, I'll explain you what to do here as well as I'll explain you what to do on the chest flies. Now, if you have the chest fly machine where the handles are way out here, we're gonna bring it forward, have our chest nice and puffed out, come forward, and we're gonna squeeze. My thing I tell people is squeeze like we have a tree trunk here, like we're hugging a tree, nice and tight. Now with this one, which is great, because it has the pads here on your elbows, I focus on coming in and bringing my elbows together. So I'm not bringing my hands together this way, I'm trying to focus on bringing my elbows together, squeezing that inner chest. So for example, I'm here, I'm gonna bring my elbows in, and squeeze. One more time, stretch it out, and squeeze. One more time, stretch it out. Do it. Never give up, boy, you gotta keep moving. Don't worry about me and what I'm doing. If anyone listening got a dream, better go for it. If you think about giving up, better hold on. I've been on my grind, hustling for so long. Pull up, good vibes, so I'm rolling. So the next chest exercise we're going to go into is a decline plate press. Now the reason why we're going decline, if you notice we hit our incline, we've hit our flat, we're targeting all three areas of the chest, the lower, the middle, and the upper. Now on this plate press, the only thing that you need to do is clasp your hands together, we're squeezing tight on the bottom of our palms, really squeezing our pecs together and forcing our weight through, nice and tight. Nice and tight, bringing it up. So, the way that I do this, I grab my plate, I squeeze my plate, nice and good. Same thing, keep my forearm, my elbows nice and tucked. 
Find a spot on my plate where my hands are even. From my chest, I'm going up, back down. Up, back down. Same routine, hoping they're playing for sunshine. The plan that don't work out as they threw Z. Looking at rappers, it's lunchtime. Sick of the drugs and the groupies. Hustling, her boy, it's crunch time. Praying the God, he don't lose me. Shout to my family. So, the very last thing that we're gonna go into is these push ups. Now, they're gonna be traditional push ups, nothing fancy about them. Getting our arms just a little bit outside of body width and really focusing on our form. Same concept we did on the flat bench, the incline, and the decline bench is we focused on pinching our elbows and our hand positioning as well as retracting our scapulas. Now, since our back isn't against something, we're not gonna really need to retract our scapulas as much, but hand position is key and still squeezing our elbows together. The reason why we're ending with this body weighted exercise, just as we did in the tricep videos and some of these other videos, is the fact that you're already burnt out, you're already tired. If we can go into this and do a body weighted push-ups, perfect. So, for beginners, if you can't do a traditional push-up, I always recommend coming off your knees. I know a lot of people say those are girl push-ups, but I don't believe in that. The reason why is because I've seen girls do regular push-ups like nothing. So this right here, in my opinion, is just a beginner push-up. We're off our knees, we're going body width. So think, keep in mind, see where my shoulders are? This would be perfectly body width. We're going a little bit out for our body, just a tiny bit. On our knees for beginners, coming straight down, pinch our arms in as we come down, and push up. Come down, and push up. Come try and push up. Now, if you're a little more advanced, we'll take our knees off and we'll be on our toes. We're gonna come down, push up. Down, push up. As we come up, squeeze that chest. Putting my thoughts on the loose sleeve on the Bruce Lee of this rap shit. Sometimes this life will get lonely and close. I'm gonna make sure that you bring a jacket. Putting my heart and my soul in this music. I can't wait too far to turn back, bitch. People all told me that I wouldn't make it now. They don't want saying congrats, kid. Used to keep money that I made from hustling right there up under my match. So, you guys see it? That was our chest workout. Went through five different exercises. We went through our flat bench, our incline bench. We went through a decline. We went into a push up. And then we also did a pec tank. Five different exercises targeting all three of the areas on the chest, the lower, mid, and upper. Really good workout for beginners. Go in and do this. The reason we do the Smith Machine is to help you guys get your form down. So if for some reason you feel uncomfortable on the flat bench, you can always use the Smith Machine as well. Once again, everybody, thank you so, so much. It's been exciting and very fun for me to continuously doing this series for you guys. I hope that you guys are progressively learning something and growing from this. We're gonna have one more episode. It's gonna be a core episode. It's gonna be all about our abs, helping out the beginners. Once again, thank you again so, so much. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Get back at your boy.